Places like this, you can't help bumping into people, can you? I suppose I had the pleasure of bumping into your father earlier in the cafe. Oh, really? Another thing about places like this, it's pretty easy to get up to speed on things that have happened in, in recent times. Unsavory things. Do you not think I'm good enough for your son? Of course, you're not good enough for my son. But what I think's irrelevant... Oh, sorry. Did you want me to sugarcoat it for you? At least I'm not a hypocrite. I told you yesterday, I know your whole story. You're a fraud, a con man. Is that so? Reputations are important to me, and yours and your father's precede you both. Yeah, well, we've all done things that we're not proud of, haven't we, Ahmet? No skeletons in my closet, young man. Is there a dead Rishi in there? Oh, I know. <laughs> it was an accident. You were the last person to see him alive, weren't you? And then you have your big argument, and suddenly he falls down the stairs and dies. Just a big coincidence, I guess. Sorry. Did you want me to sugarcoat it for you? What have you been told? What's Sunil said? Nothing. You're lying. He just said that you were there at the time, and that's it. You repeat that lie, and it'll be worse next time. Do you hear? You don't know what you've just done. Shut up! You're sick. He was my brother. It was what it was, an awful, tragic accident. I don't even know why I'm explaining myself to someone as pathetic as you. Yeah, well, you still are, though, aren't you? You're almost trying too hard. People run their mouths off without knowing the facts, and that has consequences. God, you want to hit me? Go on, do it. See what happens. You're not worth it. You stay away from me. Stay far away. <laughs>